Tell me why we had to go get the big bowl of sambal mata just because it was so good. Mm. What's up, everyone? On my last trip to Australia, I got a chance to try Indomie's new potato chip, the Chitato. They're sold online and in stores at various locations. Check the links down below. Enjoy this video. Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to a special Indomie episode of Fung Rose Food. Right now, I'm here in Sydney, Australia with AB. What's going on, y'all? And local Aussie Tan. Hello. A few years ago, me and David made a video called Five Ways to Eat Indomie. I think me likes me some me goreng. Nasi goreng. That's gotta be the best I am cremis I ever had. Cheers. Cheers. Right now, we are outside of a spot that specializes in cooking delicious Indomie mi goreng dishes. So I grew up eating mi goreng. It's really popular here in Sydney, but I had no idea there was a cafe based around it. Indomie, mi dari Indonesia. We go, we go Indomie. We are also going to be trying the all new Indomie potato chip Chitato Mi Goreng! Yeah! We got the Indomie Mi Goreng and we got the brand new potato chips right here. Let's, Let's go! go. Alright everybody, the food is flying out here. We got cold cutlery right now. This is gonna be a whole Indomie meal because we're eating flavored potato chips with the mi goreng flavored noodles. Indomie, it started from Indonesia, but it's kind of like popular like everywhere. That's very good. I like it. But um... We're gonna try the Chitato Indomie mi goreng flavor first, okay? Mmm, open it up. Let me show you this chip right here. Bang. You can smell the onion. The dried onion, the dried oh, shallots. Yeah. I like how big the chips are. Like, you know, sometimes when they deliver it, the chips break down. Like these yeah. chips kind of stay solid. No, that does taste like me goreng. It tastes like exactly like it. It's got a it spice tastes, to it too. Indomie is pretty popular out here, right? It's so popular. I think every household would have one. It's on the markets now. But time to try out these wraps and these other specialty dishes that they have here. This is a me goreng wrap that actually has noodles inside with fried chicken as well. This one. It's something else. I, I would never would have thought of putting it in a wrap. Yo, AB, Tan. Mm. Ready? Actually, you guys are cousins. Right. I will try this vegetarian one, which I know that you know people top off uh, Indomie with a lot of things, but I actually never thought about avocado. Indomie, I got, got Indomie. a lot of Indomie. It's pretty good. Mm. Nice crispy chicken right here. Mm. I really like the sauce here. What, what, what's the name of the sauce? Yo, the sambal mata, the chili sauce. Wow. You got, dude, I got avocado, I got tomato. And I even got some of the chips on the side for the crunch. Avocado, the cucumber, and the tomatoes actually is balancing out, you know, some of the saltiness and the spiciness you get from the mm. mi rang. It's delicious. The indomie is soft, and then you get the crunch from the chip. Yeah. Mmm. You know that these are some thick chips. I really enjoy them. They're good. But the wrap actually might be the easiest way to eat indomie on the go. Yeah, I gotta put this on the chip, though. It's a lot of crunch in that bite. Yeah, I know. I love the freshness that comes with that. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Can More eat. sauce. Yes. This is sambal mata. Oh. All right. You guys are dipping it. Dip the chip, man. Yo. That's good. I'm yeah. going in for seconds, man. Might need more of that sauce. He asked for extra sauce. This is more tomato based. Ah. This is just straight up red onion based. We have the campfire. I see melted cheese, smoky melted cheese, spicy beef, some hash. It's like loaded fries with mango rind. This is like carne asada fries, like to the next level. You know right what? Here. Boom. Ooh, man, so many things you can do with that chip. I'm amazed. No, the chip can hold oh, a lot no. of weight too. Look at that. <laughs> it's a strong chip. I got a nice full bite right here. You see the spicy beef. I need a French fry on there too. There you hey. Go. All right. We're so this. it up on this one. Yo. We got some white rice. We have some migrang in there. Heck yeah. Some chicken skewer and the fried chicken that they do so well here. Mm. Nice. Crisp on the outside on the skin. Can you taste the peanut? It's good. Yeah. Mm. You get the saute flavor. Tell me why we had to go get the big bowl of sambal mata just because it was so good. Mm. Mm. I think the chips really complement mm. the noodles. Yeah, guys. I just put the saute chicken with the mata on a chip. Yo. Okay, so we're talking about eggs on yeah. Indomie. <laughs> yeah. So I had to order the classic, the egg, just to dip the chips in. I love when the egg breaks apart. Hey. Oh. Mm. Does it taste the same? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, do it. Hit me with it. Ah! 
look at that. You get everything you want in that bite. You get the egg, you get the spiciness, and you get the flavor of the meat meringue on a crispy chip. The egg kind of helps tone down the spicy. We're gonna make a dip that they actually don't serve here. So we have your base for guacamole, Wait. smashed avocado. So you need a tomato because it brings out some the freshness. Flavoring. The acid, let's do some of these. Right, there you go. There you go. And then some of these pickled vegetables right here, throw those in. Oh! Mix it up a little more, there you go. Aziabo. That was nice. Mmm, good job mixing. Wow, yeah. That was that nice. Was good. Oh, woo! Yeah. Yo, I think that pretty much closes out our Indomie Mi Goreng feast from chip to noodle back to chip. This new chitato flavor, which is the Mi Goreng flavor, is gonna be hitting stores, you know, pretty soon worldwide. Mm -hmm. Judging by how popular Indomie Mi Goreng is, yeah. I can see these chips being pretty popular too. Man, it just brings back so many memories of just eating it. And then now just having it on a different scale, different level, where they add more flavoring and then the sauce. It brings a different experience to an old classic. I grew up eating me goreng and eating the chips exactly like eating the noodles, but in a potato way. I definitely think tartar is my new chip to dip. All right, big shout out to AB, big shout out to Tan. Big shout out to Kusuka. Big shout out to Indo Food for providing us the Chitato chips, man. And that is like a new thing that I've never had before. So in the comments below, let me know what other foods you would mix the Chitato Migo Rang flavored chips into. All right, everybody. Thanks for watching. And until next time, we out. Peace.